Today we are fishing for pike and I've been doing it with fly. First of all because I'm a fly fisher but I also believe it's very effective because I can fish the fly very slow and delicate and, uh, and with a puffy fly it looks very alive when under tough circumstances. I am using a sinking line to push him down to the bottom as fast as possible in the colored water with a rather short leader. Long leaders they don't work in these circumstances. It's all about getting him down fast and a long leader will keep him up on the surface and it's not good. In clear water, yes, but high waves and colored water, no. So uh, the 300 grain sinking tip, floating back, short piece, a 30 centimeter of soft wire, easy to tie, around one and a half meter fluorocarbon, directly onto the, the line. This pushes the fly down fast and this is what it's all about now, first step at least. This is a nine foot eight weight rod, it's a fast action, normally used for bonefish and small tarp on permit. It's very good for handling the wind here and the big fly and also the sink tip of course. Pike fishing is not about being delicate, it's just about getting these big bulky flies out, having them in fast. It's vulgar fishing, it's not like trout. So eight weight is by far the most used rod for this fast action. This fly is a very simple fly, it's just made of fibers with a little angel hair added into it, several of steps, a little tail here, long ones, a little body and a little head. But this one has actually been chewed up because he's taken six fish. The hook is a four rod, it's an ultra point tarpon hook actually. We both have it in uh, black nickel and in red. Ultra point again, it stays sharp longer. It has a little extra triangle uh, point to it. It can take more beating from rock. It's the sharpest hook and it stays sharp longer. Casting a fly in wind is not easy. And especially not when you have a 25 centimeter big fly on. So that's why I use this rather short belly line. It's the only way to get him out now. So what I do, a few blind cast, out he is. Here we are, I can see on the, the sonic we have around two meters of water. That means sinking for maybe five seconds. And then I start to retrieve him like this. And in a fiber fly, he will open a lot when I do like this and it stops, you know. Pull and then he will open, pull and open. It makes him look very alive. Sometimes, actually many times, to take the fly while it's sinking. But note that this is colored water. If it was clear water, I would remove him much faster. But this technique has produced six fish for now. Two meters of water, five seconds sinking, and then move him. It's a very simple technique to fish these pike. They're very aggressive, so many times it's about finding him. But we've been seeing today that it's the fly that's been catching more than the lure, so of course it's technique has something to say, but many times finding the fish. <laughs> 